Hi, I'm Sherry Gotuako from Scarlet Box. And what we do is we, our vision is to bridge the generations through arts and culture. So through art and technology, we're able to create very beautiful art pieces using our national artists' work. And in that way, we're able to work with um, galleries and museums and corporations by spreading the word, creating augmented reality for them, for immersion in the experiences of their clients, producing beautiful merchandise that have augmented reality. So many other applications that will allow a wider market or, and the younger market to appreciate our arts and culture and the works of our masters. Um, in general, anything that would lead to um, increased learning, increased awareness of whether it's new technology, art, or in the relevant fields, you know, I'm willing to support, you know, as long as I feel that I can bring value. Um, the status of the blockchain, we have very talented people, like blockchain developers, um, because we have, you know, as a nation, we have talented coders, we have talented creatives, we have talented nurses, you know, there's many talents that we have that are very, very exportable. So that's, that's kind of very important. So it's growing, it's not as fast yet. Unless there's a, you know, unless there's a special phenomenon that happens, no, like during the pandemic, very fast ang adoption ng sa GCash, you know. So it depends. Sometimes it pushes things like that, no, to a fast adoption. But now, for now, what I can see, it's uh, there's a slow, not slow, but I would say there would be a gradual good adoption. Not so fast yet, but gradual. Uh, I'm a member of the Blockchain Council of the Philippines, no. So yeah, so.